Is circumcision necessary? The Apostle Paul, he's writing the book of Romans that we're studying right now. And we're at a point where he is blasting the Jewish Christians at Rome. They need to hear his words. They're going straight to their hearts. Now there's one more thing that Paul needs to say straight to them. What is it? Well, God chose the Jewish people initially as a special people to himself to have a relationship to him. But they could become prideful. God chose us first. Long ago, the Jewish people during Old Testament time, all the way to New Testament time, they have identified with God. And what is this source of identity? Well, it's circumcision. Now, we're going to see what Paul has to say about that to the Jewish Christians. Remember, Paul himself was Jewish. For circumcision indeed is of value if you obey the law. But if you break the law, your circumcision becomes uncircumcision. Paul, he knew what the Jewish Christians thought about circumcision. Had they been circumcised? Yes. Was circumcision important to show that they were identified as God's chosen people? Yes. But if they broke God's law, circumcision became of no value. And that's exactly what they did. They rebelled against God's law. Circumcision, it meant nothing. They sinned again and again and again, just like we do, the same as us. You know, there's some Jews who still believe that if you are not circumcised, then you cannot be saved. They believe that. Now, why? Well, God a long time ago commanded that the people become circumcised to show they were his people. Now, everything has changed. Jesus Christ has fulfilled the law for us. Do not think that I have come to abolish the law or the prophets. I have not come to abolish them, but to fulfill them. Jesus Christ he fulfilled, fulfilled all of the laws. And one of the laws that he fulfilled, what was it? The law that requires circumcision. Jesus, he was circumcised for us. He was successful. Well, how does that work? Well, he obeyed all the laws perfectly. Now, question, are we to be circumcised to identify that we are God's people? No. For in Christ Jesus, neither circumcision nor uncircumcision counts for anything, but only faith working through love. Our faith in Christ alone is what will bring us into God's family. Next week, we're going to learn more about Jewish heritage of circumcision and why circumcision was important back then and now. Quorum deal.